healthcare workers, they have the prerequisite knowledge, they have the prerequisite experience, and they've also been involved in management of one form of epidemic or the other previously. Breakthrough Action Nigeria, the United States Agency for International Development's flagship social behavior change project in Nigeria, implemented by the Johns Hopkins Center for Communication Programs, supports the government of Nigeria in creating an enabling environment for preparedness, response, and recovery from emerging pandemic threats and infectious disease outbreaks. Working with and through healthcare workers during the COVID-19 response efforts has been key to this support. Breakthrough Action, in collaboration with partners in Nigeria, developed the Building Trust and Empathy Around COVID-19 Training Curriculum, which aims to not only build the skills of healthcare workers in providing empathic care, but also support them in navigating their own self-care to avoid burnout during an emergency. The training combines an in-person component along with virtual coaching support and reference materials such as the implementation plan, training participant booklets, awareness cards, posters, and learning videos. So I was happy for us to have received the letter and we actually nominated two of our staff uh, to take part in that uh, uh, training and uh, the training has been stepped down to virtually all the staff of the hospital and of course that also improved on interpersonal communication and also empathy skills. Yes, building trust and empathy is cross-cutting. It goes far beyond COVID-19. In fact, in all areas of clinical practice, it should be applied from the records unit to the consultation to the lab and to all various units that the patient will assess care. Trust and empathy is very, very important because that's when we actually appreciate what this patient passed through. Just as uh, we all know, empathy is placing ourselves in the position of the patient. And if we do this, we appreciate the challenges especially actually undergo when they come to hospital. So it cuts across all the various units of the hospital. No unit is left. Even those people that, even, that are even admitted, building trust and empathy is also being done at those various uh, places.